Hello everyone, I am Manoj Kulkarni. In this video, we will talk about how to create a master detail relationship in Xamarin Android. A master detail relationship is nothing but a design pattern where there is a list displayed in the front activity and then when we click on a, one of the item, then it's go to the detail view and displays all the details of the selected item. And in that case, we have a back button in the uh, second activity using which we can navigate to the main screen. Uh, here I have opened up the sample application. Uh, this is what we will implement. I have just a simple button. When I click on this button, I will navigate to another activity called a detail view and notice that we have a back button in the top using which we can navigate back to the main activity. So this will be the sample application we will be implementing in this tutorial. So to start with, let's create a blank Xamarin Android project. To create the project, go to the file, new project option, select from the template, select the Android template, then select the blank app project template and name it as a master detail demo and click on the OK button. This will create a blank Xamarin Android project. So let's go to our layout file and add a button. Let's delete this button and add a new button from the toolbox. We can uh, edit the properties of this button using the properties window. Let's change the text of this button to click me to navigate. Hmm? Click me to navigate and let's change the ID of this button to button click button click now we have our main activity set up now let's create an another activity for the detail view now let's right click on the project select add new item and select the activity name it as detail activity click on the add button it will create an another activity uh, now let's add the view for this activity also now let's right click on this layout folder select add new item now this time let's create an Android layout name it as detail and click on the add button this will create a layout view now let's add a text box text entry in this text view in this view so that we can here it is now let's go to the properties window and let's go to the source view and make this text appear at the center of the screen detail view let's make the height also match parent and android gravity is equal to center this will make the text view appear at the center of the screen hmm? now the next part is we need to make a master detail relationship for that purpose uh, first we need to assign the click event handle in our main activity now let's go to our main activity and delete all the sample code from here to here now let's first get reference to our button click our uh, button to get that we can type it as button click is equal to find view by id 
button resource dot id dot button click now to assign the event handle for this click event handle for this button we can type it as button click dot click double tap it will create a click event handler and to navigate to the other activity we can type it as start activity type of detail activity where detail activity is the name of our second activity and uh, to set the master detail relationship there is just one attribute we need to add in our detail activity in this activity attribute there is an another property called as parent activity and we need to set it as here we just need to specify the parent activity for this activity and our parent activity will be main activity and we also need to set the content view for this resource dot layout dot detail now if we run the application we can see our application is running now in emulator now if we click on this click me to navigate button we can see our detail activity pops up with the detail view uh, text view and we have the back button to navigate to the main activity so I hope you learn how to create the master detail view relationship if you like if you like it please uh, give a thumbs up to my video and thank you for watching